Hey, what's up and welcome back to another video today we are going to create this uh, glaze material as you can see over here and if i go here and open this material instance i will show you how to uh, change uh, how you can uh, create material instance so you can change quickly change the color of your uh, glaze material change roughness uh, change for example the opacity so uh, let's start first step is go right click and let's create one material double click to open it up i will move it here the next step is we want to make this blend mode to be translucent and over here under the lighting mode we will choose this to be surface translucency volume you can just uh, hold uh, three on your keyboard and left click uh, with your uh, mouse and connect with the base color and over here we can double click this and uh, change the color for example we can make this a little bit green Next step is to add a constant one vector. So you can also, as usual, type in constant or hold one and connect it with a metallic. And we want this value to be one. Same goes with roughness one and connect with roughness and change value to be one. Also, we need some opacity. So we'll go with a constant one vector as usual and connect it with opacity and change value to be, for example, 0.3 like this and you can see we have this translucent material it uh, already resembles uh, glass but uh, let's add uh, more nodes to make this look uh, better now we need to add some refraction so select your uh, result node and type in over here and over here under the refraction we need to enable it so you can see it over here that says refraction is disabled so we need to change this refraction method to be index of refraction and now we enabled our refraction and we can connect it with a lerp node add a fresnel node and one lerp and connect with this a and over here we will add one constant one node and make sure that this is 1.52 this is the index of refraction of glass this is a uh, actual refraction of a glass material in the real world world so use that i will put a, a link in the description so you can check out the other refractions from other materials if connect this to refraction and hit save and practically we have our material as you can see now if we go back to our level and drop one uh, basic uh, cube we can apply this material to the cube if i focus it you can see we have a nice looking uh, glass material we can play with these nodes over here but i recommend changing all these uh, nodes into parameters so we can uh, dynamically change values and immediately see the results convert to parameter with color over here it will be metallic change roughness over here change opacity and go back over here right click on your material and create material instance this will be our glass instance and so we will applied to our cube we can also add one sphere and we can add our material here and now if i select this sphere and double click to open the material glass i will move it here like this so you can change you can see the difference right away so make sure to save before you try to uh, change everything because you will not get these parameters over here if you didn't save the master material so make sure it's saved i forgot to save so i'm just well, what is this over here you can see that we have these values so we can change for example the metallic up and down or we can change the opacity and we can change the roughness and uh, we can change always the color for example we go to blue hit ok and we have a blue or we can change this to classic uh, white for example to have a standard glass material and this is how you simply set up your glass material in Unreal Engine 5 I hope this was helpful to you uh, don't forget to drop some likes and comments below and uh, see in some other video have a nice day and bye bye